I don't think that it hurts or I don't think of them being last, I guess, is the, the thing I would say. Um, because I think of a story that when we were trying to plan my C-section for this last one, I said, okay, we're going to have the baby on the game day. We're going to have a 7 a.m. Bobby, you're going to have a rough time sleeping tonight in, at, at that time, but you're going to get to the 5 p.m. game. And at 7 a.m., we're going to have a C-section. We're going to do all that, and then you're going to get to the 7 p.m. game. And I thought, this is so funny because we're literally trying to plan a birth around a game, right? And, and that's where it kind of gets to it's going to figure itself out. The game would have played on its own. Um, there might have been a few slip-ups and, you know, lineup changes not made at the time, but they're going to figure it out. And so I think it's okay that we leave our work to go pick them up. And the same thing, I don't think it's bad that you bring your kids to the softball field because think of you were that person or that kid. I would have loved to have that experience. So, um, and they get to... Anytime we drive somewhere, oh, softball game, softball game, you know, our theme is go Knights, charge on. And anytime we say good night, my two-year-old hears it, he goes, charge on. So like that's life, right? 